she paid $35 for this thing she can't use. I'm like, that's really just not the way to ask for a refund or store credit or an exchange for something you can use. Lady, nobody's gonna help you if you're leaning over the counter and screaming at them. Gosh. Call the police. Call the, right police. Here until they get Call here. the police. I'm standing right here till they get here. We're leaving. My husband's a lawyer. He's you're gonna get hit. Not your lawyer. Oh my gosh. Wow. This was wild. Okay. Bye. Okay. Bye. Back up. Back up. Just back up. She'll yeah, leave. Yeah, she'll leave. Move. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, leave, 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 back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up, back up. You're, you're crazy. No, I'm not. You know what? You guys are terrible. Your generation oh, is Bye. I just like don't know why when everyone's in like a situation like this where they're freaking out and like preventing people from leaving and general bad behavior, potentially illegal activities, um, they like to bring up their family members. You know, like that lady on the plane who's like, my brother's a sniper or something like that. And then this lady's like, my husband's a lawyer. I'm like, I do I'm not care. He could be Annalise Keating and he still can't get you out of standing behind somebody's car and preventing them from leaving. I'm pretty sure that's a crime. I don't think you're allowed to do that. Also, no way her husband's Annalise Keating. No one's Annalise Keating. <laughs> if you know, you know. Is this your store? I am a customer! So am I. I so am I. I'm a customer too, Becky. <laughs> oh my god. That lady needs to learn how to chill out. Jesus Christ. <laughs> I would have kicked her out of the store so fast. I would have been like, no, 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 no one above the age of like 10 is allowed to scream and cry in my store. Absolutely not. See you later. <laughs> no, 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 lady. You're way too old to be doing that. I don't know where you why guys, I don't know why this entitled boulder attitude has people thinking that they own bike racks and stuff, but you need to stop touching my stuff. And I mean there's plenty of other space can here. You, you hear don't what own I'm this saying? I can absolutely hear oh, what you're okay, saying. You just I, butted I said, in Is that Dude. your bike? Yes and it then is. You asked me if it was mine. Yeah, because you're like I always park on the end. That doesn't matter to me. There's plenty of other space here. We're the same type of person, man. You're no better than me, I'm no better than you. You don't you don't own the end of the rat. So <laughs> that doesn't mean you can walk in and doing this for 40 years it doesn't matter how long you've been doing it that's what's wrong with you boulder people man you're so entitled you think because you've been doing something for a long time you can like you have the right to touch other people's an unhappy person <laughs> you sound like an unhappy person says the guy who is upset that he didn't get his spot on the bike rack <laughs> like i'm just saying it's a little ironic mister if that really is the case that you were upset about that Seems like you're maybe an unhappy person. Busy would be every single table. There are three servers on, sir. We can only do so much. If you don't like it, you can go somewhere else. Who else is open? Go Nobody else. Well, exactly. you know, I'm not going to pay for a meal. Well, then bye. You're out. <laughs> I was going to say something mean, but I'm going to keep it to myself, okay? Imagine, imagine getting that angry over IHOP. How about we go? Oh, oh. Son of a You better put that right in my eye. That's on Drama at IHOP, bro. <laughs> the guy at the end, drama at IHOP. <laughs> it's so true, though. Like, that guy needs to freaking chill. Bella was warned many times she was caught stealing my package. Wow, she's going for it again, eh? Bella. No, uh uh. No, uh uh. They have you on not done. I don't believe you. Hi. Hey. So they then, did open it? Yeah, we did open it, but I promise you it wasn't. We were not trying to steal it. They have you on I camera. Know they have us on camera. So what the hell were you doing? So then what the hell were you- <laughs> Oh, like, we did open it. I, I did run here and hide my face and, and take it and run away. But uh, but I wasn't stealing it. I, uh, so what the hell were you doing then? Like, I honestly would have loved to hear, like, actually, okay, like, explain to me. What, what were you doing? Like, what were you doing? Please, walk me through the entire thought process here. Oh. 
Wow, like he came streaking in there, dude. He came absolutely streaking in. Yeah. Damn. Damn. Damn, all right guys, so I'll be honest, like I don't, I don't agree with like tossing out death threats or anything like that, but hey, this is what happens when police officers are, are freaking in uh, parking lots with women in the front seat playing with lights. You know, like this should be handled by the police. This guy had to take, uh, take matters into his own hands and go and deal with this, which should never be happening in the first place, right? It's like, this should be, you know, police have to deal with this and get on it, but like, I wonder what bike he was riding on if, if he took that one, so I don't know. Wonder, uh, wonder what that was. How would you have handled ah, this? Lady. That's greasy. Could you have kept your cool? Don't cut kind of wine. Hi, is anyone actually taking drinks here or anything? Yeah. She did? Oh, because I thought you guys were here talking and uh, all that. You can't cut in line. Hey, listen, I, I've been to my fair share of bars, nightclubs, and drinking establishments. Uh, you, you just shouldn't cut in line, man. I don't know. Wait your turn. I'm going to give you a task. Let's see how quickly you can make an old fashioned and a, a, a Coca Cola. We don't have a full bar. I can't make an old fashioned. Well, you're making those guys, whatever shots, super fancy. It took you like 10 minutes to make whatever shot of it. It's just a Akashi that was shaken. Oh, it took you 10 minutes. No, if you want it like a Akashi. Okay, so how about, let's make this different. Let's try again. I don't know why people, I don't know why people like that. Why, I think it's because I, as a whole, on the whole, on the dot, Chetty, the me, I don't think I'm more important than everyone else. I think I'm the same as everyone else. Sit down. Be humble. Even if I am an f celebrity on the internet, flash flash, ooh, yes. Paparazzi get my good side. No, but all jokes aside, I, I wouldn't cut in line because I wouldn't want that done to me. So I wouldn't do that to anybody else, even if they are strangers. It doesn't mean anything. Just a little bit of respect, I guess. Just a thought and thank, love. Just a little bit of thought and thank. That's all you need. That's it. It's kind of a weird fence. Should we measure it by the... Love it. Wow, she don't like that, is she? I, I, I do find that kind of upset. You know, I, th I think a lot of people wouldn't want to live in an apartment because you're so close to everybody and you've got so many neighbors, but you know, the apartment I used to live in was nice, man. Everyone was so great. People of all ages, all walks of life, and re really, every the building itself wasn't great, but everyone in was fantastic. But where am I going with this is, you know, some people, they want that white picket fence life. They want the suburbs, that house uh, in the suburbs. But then again, you could have a neighbor like that. And there's, you know, you can't really call the super. You don't, you don't, you, you could live on different floors. It's fine in the building, but there you're right beside each other and the fence and the money and the digging and this and that. Ah, uh, that's just, I love America. And I solemnly swear that I would be a good neighbor always. As a Canadian, I will always be a good neighbor. Pledge allegiance to the flag in the United States of America. And Chetty would always be a good neighbor. There you go. There it is, folks. I identify myself. Yes, you do. Actually, I don't. It's called common law. You should read up on it. I do not. Okay? So we both know that I don't. I am a woman of God. Oh. This is my right oh. as much as it is yours. This is her this right. This is my land oh, no, as much yeah. as it is yours. Oh, not. this is her land. And that's clearly It's clearly the, the Walmart's land. <laughs> this is my land as much as it is yours. <laughs> going to put your disgusting rules on me that are false and not true. I will not have it. Do you understand that? Here, man. She does that naturally. <laughs> She's like naturally, like she does. That's hard to focus on. She, she speaks clearly. Mm. She, there's no misunderstanding with what she's saying. Because do you remember her right hand's holding the phone, filming this entire time? Is that is that what she's doing, filming with the front uh, camera? I, I hope so. If it's the back, it's just going to be a dirty she's index finger. The whole time. <laughs> Karen doesn't know how phones work I'm either. Nice. Thought. She doesn't know how land works, how the law works, or how phones work. Or masks, apparently. Nice. <laughs> I've been watching this whole time and I'm like, what's it like in there? What's it like? How scary is Guys, this is Taylor. I talk about it all the time. My photo always appears where I'm doing this. This. <laughs> I'm not here. I'm here in person. I'm not just a ghost of the season. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm, I'm filming this whole thing for you, my friend. What the hell is happening? Uh, oh, dude. Shit, <laughs> oh my god, dude. That's like a full up like GTA sort of thing right there, man. Like, hey, hey, keep hey, backing up, keep backing up, my friend. Whoa, dude. whoa, whoa. 
What is going on? He's gonna hit you. Oh, he's gonna hit you. Everyone brace, everyone brace. No, I'm kidding. Just relax. Oh my god. What? Oh my gosh. We are in a video game. We have just stepped into a video game. How on earth could you care that little, man? Like, I'd be so shell shocked if that was me. Like, I remember, like, I got in an accident, you know, when I was like a young novice driver, I guess, and like, I was so shell shocked. Like, I was like, oh my gosh, like, this is the worst thing. Like, I thought my life was over. Meanwhile, this guy's like driving the opposite way in the thing, not caring, hitting into cars, like, cutting people off. Just like, what the hell? Shut your ass, teens, if they need any help. No. No. What the hell, dude? Like. What? That's, dude, that's just so disrespectful. It, it's so. It's just so many things. I, I hate that so much, dude. I'm not a parent. I, I don't know when or if ever I will be one, but geez, if I was, I would be so disappointed if that was my kid, man. Like just how did, how, it's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I hope that the police came here afterwards because they must have, you must call the police after this. Really just like, you know, you got, you guys got punished for it. You guys got served. Cause like, this is the worst, man. Like that poor shopkeeper asks them for help. If this video is telling the truth, ask, asks them for help. And then this is how they respond can't believe it we got this cut and no. stealing peaches hey stop when they fall don't stop don't do that oh okay, stop. okay. Whoa. You okay but I stop I pay. wow hey, you pay. stealing I and assault not one one yeah for real dude no no absolutely not let's go i don't keep up they grab his leg Wow, they did. Okay. Just some advice, you know, celebrities are people too, even if they are breakout K-pop stars. They they have their personal bubble, private space, and you shouldn't uh, you shouldn't disturb that. You should never do that. So I'm parking here, cousin, and tell me why this road uh -uh. over here in this car I, I like the traffic stuff. starts harassing me and asking me if I'm handicapped. And then I pulled out my wheelchair and I asked her if this is handicapping up, and she's flipping me off. I I'll, I'll, I think the wheelchair classifies handicap enough. I'm gonna say that classifies. I'm gonna say that counts. Listen, you know, handicap stuff, you don't know. Sometimes you can't see them. I don't understand why you'd bring that up. Like, what? You're not handicap enough to park in this parking spot. I shall alert the authorities. I, I what, like, what do you do? You're real here, and then she pulls out the wheelchair. Like, I don't know. We're people out there. Nice dog, yeah. No, this is not good. Get, get that dog away from me. Okay. Oh, a little bit of lag. Here we go. Whoa. This dog isn't friendly, man. Well, they look pretty friendly. Your dog isn't? No. That's why I have him on a leash. That's why everybody should have their dogs on a leash. I mean, he's got a point. I mean, uh, he's, he's kind of right. Yeah, your dog should be on a leash. But at the same time, I feel like maybe I'm wrong. I don't have a dog. I want a cat, man. I love kitties. Freaking love kitties, Julian. Everybody. What? Yeah, it's actually against the law to not have your dog on a leash. Okay, I didn't know you were the cops. Oh, I'm not the cops. I'm just a civilian that likes to mind his manners around other people with dogs. But like, I don't know, I feel like in the dog walking community, I feel like there's a little bit of toxicity when someone doesn't have like a leash. I don't know, I feel like there's a little bit of, you know, I don't know, it's like, watch your dog, watch your dog. I don't know, a cat community doesn't happen. We, we have cats and sometimes our houses smell. That's how it goes, you know? And it, dog walking stuff, I don't know, I've seen a lot of those videos. It's like, get your dog, get your dog. Keep your dogs close, I guess. And, and don't be, a, look, the guy looking like Pitbull is being weird. Dude, if you look like Pitbull, you can't be weird. And he had a Pitbull, didn't he? That's hilarious, oh my God, that's so funny. Jokes write themselves sometimes. The line because All right, the car yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take pictures of this, and I have. I'm sorry, you're not over the line. You're not over the line. You're not over the line. Right? You're not over the line. This isn't over the line. Yeah, see that? It's over the line. It is over the line. Ma'am, the front of the car is supposed to stop at the line. So instances like this doesn't happen. 
Excuse me? This is another one, the driving ones, where I'm gonna say it doesn't look like there's any damage done. Uh, drive away, okay, no, that, that sounds bad. I don't mean hit and run, I don't mean like that. If there's actually been damage, call the, do the proper process there. But it doesn't look like there is. So like, why are we standing here arguing? It's a sunny day. Looks like it's a weekend. Go shop, go have fun. There's no reason to, to do any of this. There's just, there's no reason to have that. The dialogue is useless, because you're never gonna agree. Okay, fine, see you later, have a nice life. That's it, that's it, it's simple. <laughs> it's great, I feel very happy. It's, I don't know. Understand why you're walking around this neighborhood this is crazy. with a bunch of packages. This is what I be talking about. Dolly. These folks be bothering me like I'm not I'm not bothering you. So <laughs> I want to complain to UPS so that you're looking very suspicious and making me nervous. Oh yes, looking very what? suspicious what? with all those packages in the middle of the day that are being delivered by UPS. And guess what? Yeah. It's a really big thing in this neighborhood for people to walk down the street for vandalism. Yes. Yeah, of course. The man breaking into cars is gonna take a bunch of packages with him. I like how she's like, hey, I'm just like the cool, you know, I'm the cool cop. I'm just kicking around, I'm just asking questions, just chilling. But here's what you did wrong though. Who are you? Get out of here. Show me your phone or your badge. <laughs> what on earth? I'm gonna call UPS. I'm like, so you know he works for UPS then? Mm. I'm like, mm. so the suspicion should just be away. You, you hit my truck. I can't Look at this big <laughs> tent right there. Bad. No, not too bad. <laughs> too bad. Pull it out with a plunger. No. Yes, you don't. No. You got a plunger and you pull it out. No. Yes, yes. <laughs> I can't believe. First of all, we need to rewind the clip back to where he said, you hit my car, and she said, no, I didn't. Mm -hmm. And then he pans over. And it's like in the car. The cars are clearly hit. <laughs> That's like a glitch in a video game. The car is in the other car. Also, I think he says dent. He's like, you dented it. I'm like, uh, hmm, my mm, friend. Mm -mm. You pull it off with a goddamn plunger. With a plunger. With a plunger. A plunger. You couldn't have backed up without hitting me and like, hitting my car? Of course I could have. I didn't know I hit your car. Pull it out with a plunger. I'm like, what about the scratches, Karen? True. With a plunger. <laughs> <laughs> pull it out with a plunger. this footloose lady. <laughs> now I hate her. Yeah, literally. Like, dancing can be destructive. Literally footloose. I need security to the Oh, let's go. Yeah. I need security. <laughs> Imagine getting kicked out to house music. Imagine going to a festival and being like, there's music here? Absolutely not. Not, <laughs> not on my watch, sister. What's a pinata with no music? Yeah. Fault. <laughs> That's weird as, <laughs> as a group. I'm like, it's, we're talking about a pinata, not a human. Okay, YouTube, relax. Yeah, they're like, what? I'm like, that's, I shouldn't bleep it. Stay here, it's okay. No. But it's on the phone. Yes. It's on the phone. No. You will get on the phone. It's not. Look. It's not on the phone. All right, you just hit me. Call 911. I'm not gonna stop on the phone after you just hit me. Like, if anything, I'm, I'm gonna go more on the phone. Like, you literally just made an attempt to attack me after you're stealing stuff from potentially me. I don't know if I own these pieces or not, but like, if I do, you're stealing it from me, or you're stealing it from somebody, and you're throwing hands at me. No, absolutely not. I'm going to get straight on my phone, keep recording you while I dial the police and bring them over here. Everything all right over here, officer? Officer, are fooling around. Uh -huh. Is everything all right over here? Yeah, everything's all right. This is normal procedure? Huh? Is this normal procedure? You have females sitting in your vehicle, playing with lights and doing everything like that? I already called the police department. I talked to your sergeant. Okay, this is totally, completely inappropriate. Uh, okay, yeah. So, I mean, that doesn't seem like something that he's going to do with the job. But what the f*** is going on here right now? I know. You have a t I don't care who you know. You have a female in your vehicle in the front seat of your car right now. I like I almost feel bad. Like he just got caught at the wrong time. But at the same point, like you're an you're a cop, dude. Like we gotta do better than this, you know? Like, well what are what are you actually doing? You're sitting in the parking lot right now. The tax dollars are paying for you. You got a woman in your car playing with the lights on. Like, aren't there other things that need to be happening, right? Like, aren't there people? I just saw a dude driving backwards on a road and crashing into the cars. You know, it's like you need to get in your car and deal with that guy. Not be doing this. Get out of my car. Who the f are you? What the, what f the is hell? this? 
Who are you? Get the hell out of here! So somebody just literally went in his car and was just like chilling in there. Who are you? No, not calm the f down. You think you just come inside someone's f car? What? This is my f car. Get the f out. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. You know, I feel bad because you have to imagine like just by the way that that went down like that interaction I don't know for sure, but you have to imagine probably like does not have a home You know, like I can't imagine that the person in the back of the car has a home there and in that regard like I feel bad At the same point like you, you cannot just go into other people's vehicles and just like make that your own Just like I claim this back seat now like this is my realm at this point like not how it works ladies Sorry about that I caught your ass stealing, didn't I? Oh. What y'all doing? What y'all doing? What y'all doing? Bro, I'm sorry, bro. What y'all doing? I'm sorry. What y'all doing? I'm sorry, bro. What y'all doing? We were just checking. We were just checking what? What were you checking? Why are you doing that? Do you need this to survive? It's unlocked. I'm sorry, bro. You were checking to see if it was unlocked? Yeah. We weren't going to do anything. So what y'all mean? I'm sorry. What y'all mean? We won't do it again. So I should call the cops, though, real quick. Nah, cause I'm your sorry. face right here on camera. I know, I'm sorry, bro. Yeah. I'm really sorry. So, 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 so I should, I should call yeah. the cops, cause y'all going through people's cars and shit while they over here sitting. Yeah, yeah, for real, man. Like, what are you doing? Yeah, like, oh, we're just checking to see if it's unlocked. Like, please, sorry, bro, sorry, bro. Like, no, you're caught now. Like, you're caught. You're, you know, and like, again, like, it, it's ridiculous. Like, you, like, they're so young. They're so young, right? It's just like, why are you doing that? Like, in this neighborhood right now, it looks like be a pretty good neighborhood. I don't want to make a judgment here. I don't believe that you need what is in that vehicle right now to survive, you know? So, like, why why should I feel sympathy for this, right? Just like, like on it, honestly, teach them the lesson early. Like, just stop it in the tracks. Like, no more. None of this i'm sorry i can't we're closed i need my phone fixed today i can't we're closed we, like i don't have enough time. i can't go without my phone how much you want i'll pay you whatever you want what you it's need not, gonna... it's not about money. i'll pay you extra for your time it's not about i need my phone i can't go without it part of me that feels like this is just like staged a little bit i'm getting that energy so we don't what kind of phone is it we don't even have the screen for it. i can't do this tonight i'm you sorry i have to do it i cannot I can't. You have to fix my phone. I can't fuck without my phone. I don't have that screen. It's impossible. Call, call get one. I don't care what you gotta do. Get my phone fixed. Monday is the earliest. No Monday. I, I can't wait. Okay. You have to leave. I'm sorry. And no, take I'm your. Not. I'm leaving. You pissed me. You have off. to. There's like part of me that feels like this is fake. I feel like I have a good radar for those sorts of things, but maybe I don't. <laughs> Um, but if not, I think it's probably good that her phone broke for a little bit because she'll see the freedom you have without it. Like last night I plugged my phone in at like six because it died and uh, kind of forgot that it existed for a while. I do that a lot. Everyone thinks I'm ignoring them, but really I just, I'm ignoring everyone. <laughs> Oops. Black hanging out with rich white kids and that's your problem. And that's your problem. Na 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 they don't I mean, really change up much. Sometimes it's like maybe it's the attitude or maybe it's the alcohol, but there's a lot of. You never know. Hmm. You never know. Just walking through the drive through. Next time you're like, hey, should we do laundry? I'll be like, na 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 na. You're, you're not the owner. You're I'm knocking on her door right now. Come. Who is her? Who is she? She's on the just second floor. Just say her name. Why She's on just, the second then floor. Then get your foot out of here no. before I call. I'll call the police. Call, call the police. Then step out. Call step out of the building. No. Step out. Step out. My step aunt out. lives on the second floor. Who's They've your aunt? They've been living here for 60 years. Who is your aunt? None of your business, so lady. That doesn't have anything to do here. with anything. What on earth? It's not your job, lady. Relax. Are you trying to like get up? Like you're like, yeah, my aunt just needs like medication for her back. If you could just. Let's go so Who's your aunt? 
Who's your aunt? It doesn't matter to you. Yes, it does. It matters it very much. It doesn't matter. Here we go. Take phone call. There's a guy who yeah. won't get out of our building. My he's he's, he's, my he's aunt lives here. the door my open and he won't step here. out. Then step outside. No. That's just a lady who needs <laughs> to mind her own business. Like, yeah. lady, how do I know you live here? You True. seem to be weird. Mm, true. You're that's acting often, real suspicious, yelling at me randomly. That's often the case. People are like, hey, are you, what's up with you? It's like, no, what's up with you? Yo, it's like when people are like cheating in a relationship and yeah. then they start to think that their partner's cheating on them and I'm like yeah. that's cuz your own weird guilt yeah where's your phone by the way <laughs> morning Karen how are you nice I love Karen's Karen's are so amazing you are, you are beautiful Karen mm. of the oh Karen mm. you are beautiful so are you oh, Karen. I love it oh mm. well Karen yeah Karen, Karen. Yeah, okay. I mean, we're taking pictures of the backyard. I, I I'm going to assume maybe he's not. Like, but I, but I don't know. I feel like if someone was creeping in your backyard, you would have called the authorities anyway. <laughs> Am I wrong on that one? I feel, I feel like you would. So, uh, nice dog though. Like it. Looks like it's a German Shepherd. Something on the lice. Yeah, looks like a nice dog. I love German Shepherds. Or the dogs are the same. I love them. They're great. They're cute. I just love that this is the default. This is like, hey, you, 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 you're going to be in some trouble. And then that's, that's the... I don't know. I, I feel like if any of these Karens were in a high school class with me and my buddies, they just, they wouldn't have lasted 30 seconds. We were hooligans. We, you know what I mean? Like we just would, yeah, oh, you're going to call the principal? You're going to call my mom? Oh no, I'm going to be in so much trouble. Like so much trouble, trouble. It, tr try me, dude. Like what do you, there's nothing you can do. You have no power here. Well, either you push it back or I could just snip, snip some of those wires, and we'll see how quick you're gonna have to push it back. Listen, listen, lady. You're gonna, you're threatening me with those scissors. Look, I could, I could probably give you a haircut too. Cause you look a hot mess. All right, I don't want, I don't want any trouble. That's, that's a problem. You see, you can't, you can't break the guy's stuff. You know. I don't want any trouble. I'll push it back. I'll push it back. I'm only a few miles down. I'll push it back. Don't come up here anymore. I don't want to see you again. All right. I'll push it back. Call the police if it happens one more time. Okay. I'm just pushing it. I'm just... Yeah. See you later, baby! <laughs> Go! What's wrong? What's wrong? This is not the monster bike uh, trail. What? You can't... You can't snip... You can't snip the wires. There's, you don't have a right to break someone's property. You never You never have the right to do that. Okay. Oh, nice cars. Excuse me, sir. I called up. And I'm going, they asked me to phone the city tomorrow. Okay, and I don't even need to know your names. A beautiful day. We appreciate I your think concern. I Take will. Care. I think I will. But you're also trespassing on his property now, right yeah. where he's standing. Yeah, that's just, uh, yeah, okay. I'm going to give the gentleman a benefit of the doubt. They got nice cars. Sorry, right where we're calling you. That, that guy in the, in the hoodie. Is it yeah, gate? No, but it goes. No, no, no. But it goes. We, we appreciate your concern. We'll, 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 he's right there. Uh, right there. Thank you so much for your concern. Where's the owner? Where's the owner? Have a great day. No, 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 no. I'm going to have a great day, but you know what? There are rules to be abided by. My husband works for the fire department. I'm going to assume if they were able to acquire such nice cars. They got a permit for doing such, shooting a music video, but I don't, again, it's tough to say. Filming, being an actor, being in the filming industry, being an amateur director, we, we, I've done amateur filmmaking myself too. Uh, it's not easy, and sometimes, sometimes you have to go rogue. It's just, it's, and anyone will tell you that. It's a part of the business. Sometimes you gotta film when you're not supposed to, uh, but it's about showing respect, being as respectful as possible and uh, getting in and, and getting out because we don't want any trouble. People tell you they don't film like that, they're just not telling the truth because they do. A lot of people do rogue filming like that. Uh, sometimes it's hard to get the Permits. Sometimes it's it's and it's, it's expensive too, you know. Uh, so that's why when I film, I try to avoid public places or places that would uh, require a permit. So. Show hands, please. Who wants to get off? We won't be going tonight if you get off. You know, I don't need this. My crew don't need this. We are doing what we can to get you out of here. It's out of my control. Yeah, but you're the one that's doing it. 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 Yeah, but you're no problem. We're doing everything we can. There's no point kicking off for the cabin crew because they can't do anything. 
There's no point kicking off at me because I can't do anything. Well, he's mad at somebody. I don't know who he's mad at. Not a great video there because I don't know. I don't know. I need context. I need contextual proof. I need the good stuff. Uh, but I'm, not, I'm not sure who he's mad at there. But yeah, I mean, he's saying the truth, you know. Right, don't get mad at me. Don't get mad at the cabin crew because I've got nothing to do with it. Here we, again, we're just pushing people here. I wish I had that kind of celebrity power like those guys do, or Elvis Presley, or the Beatles, or whoever, you know what I mean? Or the Screaming Fan, sure, why not? But at the same time, you know, I kind of like, uh, you know, keeping keeping myself private, because that's that's important. You gotta, you gotta have a life too, Chetty's got a life, that guy's got a life, everybody's got a life, they gotta live their own. I'm Bill Karen. <laughs> right out in the wild, we love it. Playing with the dust. He's Sir, just, you're made of dust, my friend. He's got no shoes on either. <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, the dust is gonna go into your house. You're gonna walk it inside. Look how far away he's going. It's, not even close. it's behind the truck. No way. Man. Also, like, close your windows and doors. I think he's mad about the sound. I think he's upset about the sound. Maybe his neighbor's getting an upgrade on a driveway. He's been saving up. He cannot afford. Great success. He sold his favorite flip flops to get a new driveway, but just it's not ready yet. It's envy. It's pure male it's Karen like, ah, envy. Ah, ah, the dust. Ah, <laughs> ah, ah. No, honestly, I think it's just uh, somebody who wants to cause a problem because they have nothing better to do. Fair. Actually, green right now. She's actually blocking the street. What are you doing? You're gonna miss the light now. Thanks. Thanks a lot. Okay. What? It's like, excuse me, you just ruined my tape. Oh no. Oh, That's no, gotta be no, fake. No, no way. No way. It's yeah. gotta be fake. No way. It's no gotta way. be fake. Yeah. But like. Imagine it wasn't. What would you do in that situation? Oh, I would Someone be busting out a TikTok yelling right out my window. Like I wouldn't have just been like, oh, I wouldn't have waited for like to no. miss the light and honk at the very end. Get the f out of the way. What the f This isn't a fing TikTok studio. This isn't the hype house. <laughs> Shut the f up. Good start. How about no? I don't care who you call. Because literally all I sat there and said was that. I'm going to call her tomorrow because this is terrible. When literally I said I could go to another carrier because I, I've done this before. All they did was hand me SIM cards. You say, and you could. Like, that's you, bad customer you're service. Your that's options not. And you're not listening to me. Sir, whenever I. Eh, you don't work here and I'm not talking to you. Eh, eh, I'm trying to give you your options. Eh, and you're not eh, eh, what we can do. Go ahead. You speak when spoken to. Like I said. You sound like the anyway. tabloid buzzer. <laughs> <laughs> you only speak when <laughs> spoken to. <laughs> If Karen said to me, you speak when spoken to, I would say, there's the door. I'm gonna do it too, next, next fight we have. Let's see what happens. Next fight? Why are you planning on more fights? We don't have fights ever, I wanna see next fight. Yeah. Yeah! Suspicious. <laughs> She's got places to be, don't all Karens? Hey. They're Hol busy. Holiday parties. <laughs> You know, God forbid you have to shovel another way out. Yeah, like... Let them do their job, okay? Like, lady. She was on the road. She's taking videos, too. But Karen is nothing she without her phone. <laughs> Reddit? You won't believe this. They're like... Yo, we don't. she would get absolutely yeah. roasted on Reddit. Yeah, yeah, these are these are great clips. Mm -hmm. That was... That was good. I feel... Like, I feel like I have a tummy ache now. <laughs> In a good way though, it was a good way. You gotta, sometimes you gotta watch what not to do. In life. Thanks yeah. for having me. Thanks for being here, we really appreciated it. Hit that thumbs up for Taylor and uh, let us know down below in the comments all of your thoughts and feelings on him, okay? Yeah. I wanna know, I wanna know. You can't wait, science has no eating and drinking. You don't get it? You don't get it. You must be stupid. I've seen people like you on TV. Oh my gosh. Imagine like being pressed over somebody eating a burrito. Like the only thing that I would be mad about is that I don't get a bite. <laughs> yes, please. Can we get a policeman on board here? We got somebody dining in the first car. Number 356. He's dining, dining. Eating on the train? Eating on the train? You should smile. Like, the, imagine trying to call the police. 
to the car because you're like, well, there's a sign right there that says no eating or drinking. Sir, relax and mind your own business. I hope that burrito was good. <laughs> oh, people just love to get in other people's business for no reason at all. Because I'm pathetic. I think the funniest part of that, and I, the music will probably be cut out for you guys, but in the actual clip, it's playing Pump Up the Jam. <laughs> is just going to town on a car. No worries, I mean, he had the right music behind this act. <laughs> oh my God. Jeez Louise, he really didn't want to let this Karen pass. No worries. You're kidding. <laughs> and these people are so stupid. Is <laughs> good? <laughs> what an absolute idiot, dude. I swear, like, these people, like, the people that actually choose to steal, like, nothing going on up here, everybody. There's not a whole lot, right? Like, how could this guy be so unaware that he's stealing this dude's bike while there's, like, literally a guy standing behind him with the camera? You'd think that you'd know. You know, like, you'd think that you'd go up, be, like, looking around. No, this guy's just, like, it's just dumb. Just, like, literally so dumb. Man, <laughs> don't start something you can't finish. You better go! Get out! Cause like realistically, if the guy wasn't saying things like exit the premises and instead was just like giving the same energy back and was aggressive and tried to start a physical altercation like she was. Exit the premises. <laughs> that girl is a Karen, that's for sure. I don't think it would have gone well for her. I'm just saying. I think she would have regretted all of the things that she said leading up to that point. So, uh, yeah, just don't start something you can't finish. Is <laughs> that, That's my reaction. <laughs> I'm telling you to get out of my face. I need that No, it froze. This is privacy only. It's private communication. I already told you that. So Hi. get out of my face. Mm -hmm. Excuse you. I need you to leave. I'm not leaving. Ma'am, I need you to get out of my face. I'm not leaving. Get out of my face. Oh my gosh. Like, why when somebody's telling you to leave an establishment, do people just say, no, I'm not gonna leave? Like, sorry, you don't get to choose. I'm not leaving. Get out of my face. Stop it. Are you gonna hit me? Stop it. Are you gonna hit me? I'm gonna call the police. Get out of my face. Ma'am. Get out of my face. Don't touch my phone. Get Do out of my face. Do not touch my phone. Get out of my face. This is a business. This is a private property. Okay? If I tell you to leave, goodbye. Goodbye. And if you don't, you know who's gonna come? The police. And guess what? They've got other things to do than deal with Karens, okay? Just because a lady wants to wave her phone around. They're busy. Just leave. Just go to the next door. Tell us. You're not welcome here. Spent $35 for a Sunday I can't use. That your salesman sold me. No, it's damn well. Matt, I can't hear what the employee said, but I could definitely hear what that Karen was absolutely screaming about. 